In this video, I'll show you how to create smooth rolling text in Premiere Pro. Let's jump right in. Begin by selecting the Type tool and adding your text. Then double-click the text and adjust it using the Essential Graphics panel. Once the text layer is selected and highlighted in red, press Ctrl plus C to copy it. Move to the end of the word, press Enter to create a new line, and then press Ctrl plus V to paste the same word. Next, adjust the line spacing by lowering this value to bring the two words closer together. Just make sure there is still a little space between them. Now continue adding new lines and pasting the same word until you have around 20 copies. After creating enough duplicates, align the entire text horizontally and vertically so it sits perfectly in the center. Then go to the Effect Controls panel. Under Opacity, click the rectangle icon to create a rectangular mask. In Mask 1, set the feather to 0. We now need to adjust the mask so that it covers only the single word in the center. Select the Selection tool, click and drag to select the top mask points and move them downward. Use either arrow keys or your mouse. Move these points close to the text but leave a small gap. Then select the bottom mask points and move them upward. After that, select the left points and drag them fully to the left and do the same for the right points by moving them all the way to the right. This ensures only one word stays inside the mask. At this stage, open the Effects window and search for Directional Blur. Apply it to the text layer. Make sure the time indicator is at the start of the layer. In Effect Controls, create a keyframe for blur length by clicking the stopwatch and set the value to 10. Next, expand the text options, the section that contains the actual written word. Scroll down to Transform and create a keyframe by clicking its stopwatch. Then decrease the second position value to move the text upward until it becomes invisible. Move forward about 3 to 4 seconds on the timeline. Set the blur length to zero, then go back to the transform settings and increase the second position value to move the text upward to the very last copy. The one at the top, make sure everything lines up perfectly so only a single word is visible. Select all the transform keyframes, right click on any of them, choose temporal interpolation, ease in, then right click again and choose ease out, expand the arrow next to position, open the graph and drag the second blue handle completely to the left. The graph should match this shape and that's it. Your rolling text animation is now complete. That's all for today's tutorial. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more informative tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.